Oh, you gotta be fucking kidding me. Please say psych right now. Wait, how far have we been walking for exactly? I don't know, but we should get a move on. Standing here is suicidal TBH. <laughs> Oh no, a dead body. This only means bad news news. Possibly, but I also haven't seen any zombies here either. But... Oh, this is bad. What is it? Look at that sign. Oh no, 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 please say fucking psych, please. We're in Georgia and there's zombies, and the military is unaware? Oh, this is so very much a 180 of what is the definition of good. You're screwed. Yeah, you're totally screwed. Look out. God damn it. Whoa. I'm not even going to ask where you keep all of these weapons, because I don't think the creator of these videos follows logic 100% of the time. Let's be real. Oh, come the fuck on now. Who doesn't have a personal pocket TARDIS in current ye? Anyway, let's use the car since it appears to be in good condition, aside from the new paint job he he he. I think your shotgun just revealed our location. We need Here they come. Wait, they've gone from walkers to walkers now? Back, it's a well, this is nice, going in reverse with a horde in front of us. This is quite possibly the worst front row seats I've ever gotten. I mean, surely you were kidding about the military being unaware about this situation, right? Meanwhile... Alright, time to scorch earthy zombie fuckers back to hell. So after we do a little bombings in Florida, we should be all good. Yep, that's based off the reports we've got. The governor of Florida told us that there's been no reports of zombies at the Florida border so we bomb the flooded regions and this problem will finally be finished. Now, let's get into position. Later. Well we did boys. The zombies have been eliminated and that means the issue of zombies is solved and it will never come up again. Meanwhile. Well, despite their fucking bullshit, wonder how those bombings have been going? I don't know, how about we turn the TV on? Breaking news as the military reports that the last zombie has been eliminated in their bombing of the evacuated city of Boca Raton, Florida and... Wait a minute, they also fucking bombed goddamn Florida? Do they not know what the Gators and Florida man is like down there? Also why am I even working this job? Huh? Well at least they'll let people evacuate the cities, but I'm skeptical that they killed every single zombie. There's no way they leveled every single building in those major cities. I agree, but if the zombies are truly gone forever, then I'm not complaining. What kind of drugs did I ingest to be working in a random news station in Alabama? But hey, at least I can return to DC and leave in peace now. Wait, why is there a guy just standing in the road like that? <laughs> well thanks to that drunken idiot, my car is now a total wreck, and even weirder is despite crashing, not a single person came out of the buildings. That seems kind of creepy not going to lie. Surely, there's someone in this town right? No. Holy shit, what the fuck just happened over here? Whoa don't aim that thing at me. Oh sorry, thought you were one of those lunatics. Luna what now? Some lunatics from Florida who came here due to the tidal wave. But they entered this town, they began to attack people. I'm one of the few who got a weapon and killed some. But who knows how many escaped into the rest of the state. Um, excuse me for just a second. <laughs> I cannot fucking believe this. The president ordering those bombings and then lying to the public about the status of the outbreak when, in reality, zombies are in Alabama is so embarrassing. Wait, but I heard your voice over the radio. That was a paid actor sent by the FBI to sabotage me because I'm the only voice of reason in the goddamn government apparently. Anyway, we need to find as many survivors as possible and make a resistance group against the government to show we're tired. This bullshit, because if there's zombies in Alabama, 
I fucking guarantee, there's zombies in Georgia and in probably other states as well. Hell, they probably didn't even kill all of them in D.C. Do you really think we'd be able to stand up against them, though? Yes, I absolutely think we can. As someone who was just fired I can tell the people running the joint couldn't run a fucking simulator without getting their hand held. Anyway, standing out here seems like a bad idea, let's book it to one of those buildings. Yeah, I agree. While he knew the unnamed British guy was also stupid. There's zombies running at super speed in front of us and he's on the news saying there's no zombies left. He's such a hypocrite. Well, to be fair, we're the people aware of these zombies since it appears that they wiped out an entire fucking town soon. Oh fuck, what was that what? Okay. <laughs> Backwards like that. Dude, get back in your car. There's zombies coming. What kind of an excuse is that? So, on what's the game plan now? Well, no. Well, I've done all I Is the weapon you have in your black hole pocket seriously a fucking RPG? I thought you had a sniper rifle or something. I do, but there's no way I'd be able to kill even one of those enemies without getting killed. Unless... Ah, here we go. What? What the fuck? How did you even fit that in your... You know what? Not even going to ask. Time to light these motherfuckers. <laughs> yeah, that's right, you zombie freaks. You were no match to my pocket death machine. Had ha had ha. Also, can you get that car started? Well, the car just answered the question with a resounding sputter and fail. Well, I guess we're walking until we find a town that didn't get hit by the zombies. Well the question is, just how fast did the zombies spread from Florida to Georgia, because if they wiped out King's Land, who knows what the state of cities like Atlanta are. That's a good point, but it's starting to get dark, and I'm not fucking walking in the damn dark you know. Yeah me neither. <laughs>